When it comes to beauty, there's not much you can teach Annette Kellerman. After all, I have been scientifically described as the perfect woman. A professor took my measurements, so it must be true. Now, don't hate me, ladies. Like you, I was once dumpy and plain. But with a little effort, you too can look like this. How, you ask, when I'm consumed by the drudgery of housework? Simple. Bounce a little on your toes. Grab that duster, up she goes. It's how the modern girl behaves, tickling the architraves. Grab that broom, it's time to sweep. Take those lanterns nice and deep. Goodbye, wobble, farewell, sigh. Doing the dusting rag. Let's get the dustpan and brush. Stretch those hamstrings, girls. Down we get to scrub the floor. Keep one leg raised behind. A few weeks like that and we'll have an army of Dianas putting the bins out. Step out lightly onto the tiles. Mop them brightly. Come on, ladies, I want smiles. Peg those sheets up good and high. Roll out pastry for your pie. Bicep curl that shopping bag. Doing the dusting rag. Love, we are told, is incidental to a man. But for a woman, it's the fundamental fact of her existence. But once she's married, should she dare to look after her figure, she's branded a hussy. The result of this is we've got shapeless wives battling their buttons and husbands filing for divorce. Dear God. Women. Vitality. Magnetism. Symmetry. These are your birthright. Fireplaces, grime and soot, scrub them standing on one foot, lip the other overhead, finished, good, well, make the bed. Step out lightly, wax the parquet, beaming brightly, do it all again next day. Every surface gleam, look at you, a heavenly dream. A cup of tea, a well-earned fag for doing the dusting rag, doing the dusting rag.